Good morning. When I heard this office was closed, come on, first let me introduce myself. I'm a veteran and a Social Security recipient. All right. Okay? This is important to me. It's important to people I know, important to my family, friends, and even people I don't know. But let me tell you what happened when I heard that this office was closed. I was shocked. I just couldn't believe it. But I went from being shocked and confused to angry. I'm angry because if you go to a Social Security office now, it's understaffed. They're long lines. People are trying to help recipients as much as they can. And it, sometimes you have to go back two or three times before you get service. Now, I've gone with several, I'm a senior myself, but there's a few seniors older than I am. I've gone with them, and they had to go back. They had physical disabilities. They couldn't stand in line all day. There was no seats for them and everything. Then we're going to close the office. It makes no sense to me. It makes no sense to veterans I talk to. It makes no sense to Social Security recipients I talk to. So here's what we're saying. We're saying, I, I love these speakers before. They're real nice. I'm saying, how can you be so stupid? Okay, how can you treat people the way you are treating people if you plan to close this office? We have paid into the system. We paid for two things. We paid for our benefits and we paid for decent service. And we're not getting any of them if they keep this up. So what we're doing, we're calling for no more closing of offices. We're calling for full staffing. As for this office, I endorse the hell no, you're not closing it. So if you help me, hell no, we're not closing it.